Heather Marcelli here to talk with you about how to eat healthy on a budget. And if you are the kind of person that believes that eating healthy is expensive, stop there. I'm not gonna talk about those fancy products, perhaps gluten-free, sugar-free, dairy-free, superfoods. I'm gonna talk about eating real food without breaking the bank. So the first tip is gonna be go to the farmer's market and I know that's not always the cheapest place because it depends where you live but also I know that you can always make some good deals perhaps you can go by the end of the day they always have something good and you're gonna pay much less for this and the quality is gonna be much better because they are fresh they are nutritious uh, much better than the one you're gonna find at the supermarket the second tip is buying bulk and you can buy in bulk quantities at the farmer's market or at the supermarket. For example, you can buy uh, beans, lentils, nuts and other things, other products that last long in a bulk quantity and then you're gonna save money. You can buy uh, fruits and vegetables and you can freeze them, then they are gonna last for long and they are always there for you. So always try to buy what's in sale uh, in big quantities and then you can save money again. Another tip is to find some alternatives for eat what you like and what's healthy for you as well. For example, if you like to eat um, tomato sauce, sorry American English, I'm gonna say tomato. So if you like tomato sauce but organic tomatoes are very expensive, uh, then you can try to find a canned organic tomato that's much cheaper and also uh, healthy for you but you have to read the labels because most of these um, tomato sauce they are gonna have for example sugar, salt, fat, other ingredients that are not healthy for you so always read the label and try to find out if it's only organic tomatoes on there then you can use that canned tomato and mix with some garlic, onions, add some tomatoes for example fresh tomatoes then it's gonna be delicious and much cheaper as well the fourth tip is buy what is in season so go online check what is in season for you right now because it varies from a state to another a country to another so check what is in season for you and buy that product because that product is gonna be much nutritious and also cheaper for you because they are in the market in big quantities right now so take advantage of that and the fifth tip is always read the label because then you know what you are buying check for the first ingredients because those are the ingredients that are there in more quantity in bigger quantity and then you can see for example if you're gonna buy a chocolate if it's more full of sugar or cocoa or cacao that's very healthy for you also check uh, for words that you don't know because if you find some words that you don't know you cannot pronounce it probably is not healthy for you and try to buy products with a very short list of ingredients because this means that it's more pure so it probably is gonna be healthier for you than other products for example when you're gonna buy yogurt try to buy a yogurt with a very short list of ingredients as well and the last tip is cook so go to your kitchen and start cooking your meals because it's gonna be cheaper and also much more nutritious for you and for your family and if you don't know how to cook you can always go online check some videos try some recipes you're gonna make the first time perhaps it's gonna be a disaster but then you can make it again the sec second the third fourth time and then it's gonna improve a lot and you are gonna enjoy this process of cooking but if you don't like to cook then uh, I will say try to find a way to enjoy this process perhaps you can get family and friends together and then you can make something fun then it can help you and then uh, you're gonna cook something delicious and also you're gonna have fun because cooking is very important the same way we have to brush our teeth and we have to take shower so we have to cook to be healthy so I know I talk a lot already so I'm gonna try to sum up a little bit then it's gonna be much easier for you to remember so the first one is go to the farmers market and then you can make a good deal and buy products that are fresh more nutritious uh, high in vitamins and minerals the second one 
recipes for you to buy in bulk, bulk quantities. You can always make a good deal. You can always save money and you can always freeze uh, vegetables and fruits if they are there with a good price, um, perhaps also in season right now. And then you can save for another month when it's not in season, very expensive and not so nutritious. The third one, it's gonna be for you to find some alternatives. For example, the tomato sauce. You can try to buy the canned tomato sauce, but the one that's pure as well. The fourth one is for you to buy what is in season right now, that's more nutritious and also cheaper for you. The fifth one, read labels, is very important for you because you know what you are buying. And the last one, Let's cook! Let's go to our kitchen and then start preparing some meals and then we can kind of rescue this part of us that we let there for a long time. We didn't explore that much but it's very nice to cook, it's very important for you and enjoyable as well. So I will see you next time! Bye bye!